Sorry we've been away for the past couple months. We've all had loads of deadlines creep up on us all of a sudden. I had about five or six different projects due within about two weeks of each other, which wasn't fun. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we are back on track now though. And it is Christmas. So what better way to make it up to you, eh? With my shoddy university student decorations. I swear that tree is gonna set itself on fire soon. So just over a week until Christmas. That sounds really weird. This Wednesday just got my came down. We did all our Christmas shopping. Normally, I really freak out that I'm not gonna have enough money for Christmas presents, but I got some good deals in. Hopefully, people that I brought them for will like them. I don't see why they would do it. It's not like they're gonna open on Christmas Day and go, oh my God, this is awful, and throw it back in my face. I'm actually going home for the holidays. Tomorrow, in fact. We have a very traditional Christmas. We wake up whenever we want to, eat whatever we want for breakfast, go down, unwrap presents with each other, and then have some kind of Christmas meal. And then I scurry off to my bedroom and watch Doctor Who. Very excited about. I'm happy sad is what I've come to the conclusion about. Sad that Matt Smith's going because he has been the best Doctor, I think, for a very long time. He's up there with Tom Baker and Patrick Troughton as my favourite dog. So at the same time, I'm stupidly excited for Peter Capaldi. The original crafty girl, Randall Brown from The Hour. I, I mean, when it was announced, if you saw my Twitter, you'll know I freaked out. I'm sure I'll be both crying and cheering when it comes to the conclusion. It's, it's gonna be very good. It's gonna be very, very good. So let me know down below in the comments, what are you doing for Christmas? And as always, if you like this, don't forget to leave it a thumbs up and hit subscribe for more. And Ellen, we will see you on Wednesday.